because that was part of what happened for towns that were larger under GASI 34 and the whole capital measurement process. And our recommendation is that we look at, have a study done of the roads in this next year, and forestall any changes in our tax rate until we really know where we stand. One year, do the study, make an intelligent decision, and then project our revenues, our capital expenditures, and our operating requirements once we know them. Then we can make a decision of, can we drop? How much can we drop? And why, um, on the night after we've already adopted the tax rate um, this week, are we being presented with this information for the first time the night of the final budget hearing versus weeks ago or when we could have implemented this into our decision-making process? Time? We hadn't actually done this type of preparation before in the budget analysis. We'd like to see this become a part of the process for the future. Okay. And it was just a question of, we'd like you to have this information before you make a final decision. And obviously, from this point forward, it would become a part of it. And I think our, part of our problem is that that type of infrastructure planning wasn't done in the past and that we're ending up stuck with the bill basically because the road maintenance wasn't done and now we're playing catch up and that's that's sort of not our fault not to you know it's not a question of fault it's just the realities of what you have to deal with right. today i mean it's kind of like you can go back eight years and talk about who right who could have who would have but let's really deal with the, the issue today and we're looking at this scenario going give yourself another year to make an informed decision Know what your capital requirements are as you move forward. And instead of having to jump around on your tax rates, give us time enough to make an evaluation, to collect the data, and to give you a very sound projection of what our capital needs are. Because if they're less than this and you can afford to do a rate re decrease, you can do it informed. Yeah, Patty, uh, are you basing these, these scenarios on the 45 cent right now, or are you basing this on the all of these analyses were done based on the rate decrease because that's what I understood to be what we had to really give you with right now. Rate decrease. Decrease. That 45 is the, the the real impact in the first year is about eighty three thousand right. dollars. It increases by three percent each year after that because basically it's eighty three and then eighty three thousand times one point oh three. It's it, it creeps up. But what we're really saying is. It's not just that that we need to be focused on. We need to stop and take the view from 10,000 feet and really know what our requirements are going to be before we make a decision on rate. The problem is we already made the decision. The motion was made, seconded, and it was passed already. So I'm just wondering, what are your thoughts? Back and change it. Again, just go back and yeah, basically we send said, the yeah, tax but we haven't, we haven't voted on the budget. All we did was say we wanted the tax 